So this is behind um, Ulitsis Water, uh, the garages. Now we have uh, part of the wall from the ghetto, which is quite it's quite a large section, in fact. And uh, we can see it was knocked through; it's been slightly repaired, but we can recognise certain uh, things from, from as, as as the structure. This was built in uh, November 1940. Uh, it was contracted to some company who uh, obviously it was all paid for by the uh, Jewish community and this is quite a large fragment you can see uh, a smaller fragment further on where there's a, uh, there's a sign and something like that and the buildings on the other side would have been in the ghetto and where we're standing now is outside the ghetto the buildings on the other side of course are all uh, from the socialist period, this is all from the 1950s, 60s. And behind that, just to show where we are exactly and how close is the centre, we have there we have the uh, Intercontinental Hotel, and we have uh, another office block beside it. So it's probably it's bang in, bang in the centre. Um, although, like many parts of the centre, it still looks very socialist, and uh, it doesn't look best, of course, people have to live somewhere, and uh, I must point out that living in places looking this rough in Poland is actually much less rough, if at all, uh, when compared to living in such horrible looking places in the United States or the United Kingdom.